Hi there, I'm Steve Medlin. Let's talk a while. So you're starting a business. That's great. I wish you much success. Perhaps you are growing your business to the point that you need to incorporate. Remember that there are many, many different types of business corporations, limited liability companies, professional corporations, other legal entities also all of them with a different purpose. I want to see you get started right and continue on the right path with your business entity. Which of these business types is best for your particular situation? Why have a corporation for your business? Why have a limited liability company or other corporate entity? When you do business as a sole proprietor, you are the only one that owns the business. You take your business out to the public. It is you out there all alone. You take your business out to the public and it is there is nothing protecting you and your personal assets, bank accounts, home, cars, everything you own personally. When you incorporate, you have created a separate legal entity into which you transfer your business assets. You operate through that legal entity. If something goes wrong and a lawsuit judgment comes against that legal entity, only the assets of the corporation business stand good for the judgment. Your personal assets are protected by your properly created business entity. I give you a real life story an example of why it is important to incorporate. We have all seen it happen. Three friends, known each other for life. They get together, shake hands, and go into an informal business together. A few years later, business being very complex, one of them has come to me because the arrangement is not working out. One person is not pulling his weight. Another is creating many, many problems for the company. My client is doing all the work and not getting paid for it. We have a problem because I look at my client, I ask, where are your legal documents? Where's your corporation? What have you memorialized to be sure your arrangement with your friends is understood by everyone? Tell me how you have handled your filings, corporate records, business records, accountings. What arrangements were made? to be certain as to the responsibilities of all the parties. I know you have heard other attorneys will do quickie, cheapy business incorporation. There is nothing more expensive in your life than a quick and cheap legal fix. It will cost you a lot of money down the road. Other attorneys often use fill in the blank forms, templates into which all the needs are hammered the square peg of your business life is pounded into the round hole that fits the computer program. I don't do cookie cutter. Your situation, your individual situation is unique. I will look with you to uncover the true nature of your business, the risks that it faces. I will work with you to craft a unique situation and a unique solution for your business needs. Working closely with you, I ask a lot of questions, including the right questions, to get to your real business challenges. Let me caution you. An internet-generated corporation or limited liability company or papers from a form book are too imprecise and too broadly drawn to serve you. Using those shortcut methods is taking the square peg of your business plan and pounding it into the round hole of an overly generalized method. That internet corporation won't do for you. It was drawn to cover many, many states, many different types of situations, not your unique individual situation. The internet or the form book can never ask all the relevant questions that must be properly answered. When you use an internet generated corporation, form, your, your words, or those of the legal documents. Well, there's, those are the words of imprecision. The courts, on the other hand, 
are required to use precise legal meanings for your words. The courts will take your words and force them into legal holes, changing the meaning of what you intended. Let's use the proper legal terms for your documents, your legal documents right from the beginning. Draft your legal documents correctly from the outset. Make sure your legal documents accomplish your purpose using precise legal terminology. What is it about your business and your dealings with the public that make you unique in all the world? Let's work together to craft your business entity to serve your needs and protect you. Let's make sure your business entity serves your needs properly set up. It is more than just getting started. It is going the extra mile to finish the job. Make sure all the papers are there, the legally required documents, and have a corporation at all. Make the minute book right. Get your corporate seal in place. Have your annual meetings. Make sure that the CPA, the tax preparer, has the right documents from my law office so they can do their job also. I'm the one to get you started in the corporate world. I'm the one to keep you going in the right direction in the future. Make sure the right papers are prepared at the right time and prepared correctly. Work closely with your tax preparer or anyone needed to be sure you're acting like a corporation. You want to be treated like a corporation by the law. Your corporation will have needs in the future. Employee matters, contract matters, expanding into new markets in different states. Let's work together. You need to know I will work with you. Write the contracts to protect you as time change and as business expands.